Hey guys, what happened recently is a very good example. Here you can see a sale from Europe for a bunch of Rudy promos, and they're not going for hundreds of dollars, guys. This entire promo set of 32-ish promos, some of them graded, only went for less than, I think it was 240 euros, which is <laughs> probably less than $300. So we have a interesting thing to look at, which is a lot of people are actually liquidating their meta zoo because they're afraid that this game is dead. So we finally get to see what the actual price of these promos are. And surprising no one, they are far less. We also see the play mats and so on. They're basically worthless. So you might think it's unfair, right, for me to pick this point in time when the game is dead. But at any other given time, there was no liquidity. So about $255 with some shipping. So 51 almost $300. A little bit over $300. You too could buy a large collection of Rudy cards. These are sold, which means they're probably best offers, right? Um, you can kind of give a good example of, you know, auctions and so on, I think, are more realistic. I look to auctions when I want to know when something is sold. You can actually run these exact things. Oh, here's the Nightfall kit. The $800 night or what, $600 night, Nightfall kit is now only $81 plus $18. So you can buy for $100. The seller is probably out 500 600 dollars most maximal here you have uh, rudy promo lots you can see a lot of people are selling their rudy collections and they're saying that we are not going to diamond hands it remember rudy told them to diamond hands how many of you guys remember that video where rudy was telling them to diamond hands their promos the diamond hand club as he mentioned this is a disaster guys like people are just offloading their rudy cards on a paste you can see the date i want you to focus on one thing and it's the date this is liquidity but it's liquidity at cost and you might be like what does that even mean i mean this is the real price oh there's catch them all collectibles free shipping it probably costs almost as much money to ship this play mat as catch them all collectibles gets from it right no joke and that's the vaulted uh first edition nightfall kit so that was the eighty two hundred dollars i'm always talking about of course you would get five play mats you can see that none of them best offer accepted by offer accepted yeah they're getting remember it costs fifteen dollars in about four months of your life to get a card graded then for you to sell it at this point offer free shipping is quite interesting right here is why is that autograph by Rudy himself? 574.99 sold. Okay. PSA 10 auto 10 poncho. Okay, poncho auto. Here's one $50. Best offer accepted. Buy direct. Free shipping. Maybe they bought more of this. But finally, you can see the dates. They're all this month, right? People are mass selling their Rudy cards. Here's the Crown Eater, the famous Crown Eater. Here's Meta Zoo, Rudy Totally Not a Timmy from the Czech Republic. Also, like when you look at what countries that are selling these cards, it's kind of interesting. Czech Republic, Europe, right? Uh, here we have a PSA 10. A lot of people got their Timmy's graded. Uh, Meta Zoo, catch them all collectibles, you know, trying to sell as many play mats as you can <laughs> while the time is good. You know, it's interesting. All these people who believe in Meta Zoo, catch them all collectibles, Argos Anonymous. I almost purchased something from Argos. And I was like, yeah, he probably isn't going to ship it, is he? He's just going to cancel the order. So I ended up not buying that from Argos. It was uh, a case of Cryptid Nation 2nd Edition for like $10, $15 a box. Here's their Rudy Gem Keeper. Oh, best offer accepted. You're going to see a lot of uh, best offer accepted, right? Rudy Nice Metal, PSA 9. 
People are really just trying to get rid of their Rudy product. These are his most ardent supporters, by the way. There's a, there's been a flood of this product just hitting the marketplace. It's kind of interesting to see. It's actually liquid. For the only time in Rudy's history, his cards are liquid. But, I mean, you're buying, spending $300 from Germ oh, Germany. And you get 34 Alpha investment promos, including PSA 10s. All right. Oh, I mean, you got people reselling his t-shirt. Yeah, I mean, he's making a shit ton of money, guys. But, like, this type of stuff, it's liquid. Since MetaZoo announced that they're going belly up, CEO announced that, there's been, like, a... There's been a flood of people just trying to sell their Rudy cards. Here's another one. Total of eight. $275. Buy it now. Alpha Investment Exclusive Card Lot. Rudy Investment Sasquatch. Total eight. Yeah, it's all, it's all eight of them. Oh, maybe he's missing one. He's missing a crown eater. He's missing another one. But if you want to jump in and buy some Rudy promos, now is the time. The Red Crown. $51 on auction. Plus four... Fan art booster packs. Play mats for about $10. Free shipping. I mean, that's probably what this stuff is worth. Very low print run. <laughs> Learning from their master. Anyway, uh, my point is quite kind of simple. And it's something that is really obvious. Is like, these cards were never worth what Rudy said they were worth. They're only worth what they sell and what you can liquidate them at. And people are liquidating. In fact, I'm looking at the real prices and they're not they're not even half. The buy now offers on a lot of this that was accepted is less as half, just about half of what, um, like especially gold metal stuff. It's like $20 a slab. It's interesting. A lot of these promos are hitting the market. And there's not a damn thing he can do about it. Because this is the actual price of these cards. Not the fake prices that he has. Rudy Really Big Feet PSA 10. That went for $45 at auction. There's another playmat. Uh, 37 playmats. Holy shit. <laughs> wow, I gotta put this one on. 37 playmats went for 10 euro. Which is $10.77. 37. 20 Cryptid Nason Second Edition. 12 Wilderness. Free UFO. Who? These guys got mother effing hosed. Holy shit. Who's buying 37 kits? Wow. That's mind blowing. Wow. This dude has 37 playmats in somewhere in Europe. In Germany. Rudy got to give this guy a medal. Holy shit, man. 37. <laughs> and all he got was one bid for $10.07. I mean, come on, guys. What the hell are we talking about? What the hell? I didn't realize I was 37. Holy mo, 37 of them. And 34 of his promos from the Germany. That guy in Germany got hosed. I think I found, like, the biggest loser in all of this is one dude in Germany who has 34 alpha promos and 37 playmats. And he sold all his playmats for $10.77. And he sold all his promos for $259.59. Yeah, man. It ain't, going, it ain't looking good for Alpha Investments. Investing in Alpha Investments. Stock is down. Yeah, 37 mother effing playmats. Are you kidding me? For 10 Yeah, you see that right there. But you can see the shipping is a lot. But it's from Germany. Like, there's some dude in Germany... Who has like an infinite amount of like MetaZoo cards from Alpha Investment. And he's like, I don't want any of this stuff. I'm going to go. I'm going to dip. Man, I, I think I found like his biggest fan. 